Yo, what is up guys? It's me, the most practical of Asians, or practical Asian. It's right there in the name. And today we're just going to be talking about Jack Doherty here. And let's be honest, we all know he's a dickbag. Like, no one likes him at all. And he's just so insufferable. But what's the news with him? Why am I even caring to talk about him when I never cared before? Well, the thing is, the guy is getting sued. And the interesting part is, the clip I just played from the intro is the reason why. Here, let me just play it again so you guys understand what I'm talking about. No, what's up? I'm just saying, why? Oh, you're what? Why? You're why? Why? Chill, chill, chill. No, no, no. You all say, why? 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 Hey, what's up? Hey, one by one, what's up? Fucking security guard on you. Fuck you, bitch. Walk. Dude, what's wrong with you? Fuck you, bitch. You can fuck my face, nigga. Yo, you're flat your shit, nigga. Yeah, totally not cool. And just so you know, the victim here could have had it a lot worse. Like that punch was not just bad, but when he fell onto the ground, that really could have hit his head and there could have been way more complications. And I refuse to ever think that, oh, Jack Doherty did nothing wrong here. Look, with the way he makes his content, he's always going out to just cause problem with people and it shows. Now, how did we get here? Well, it all starts with uh, one of his videos from back in the day with Walmart. And let me just show you a clip about what happened in Walmart. Don't don't take pictures of me. I'll break your camera. Mm, no, you won't. Yes, I will. I doubt it. I'm 15. Yes, You'll go I, to jail. I don't care if you're 15. You'll go to jail. You, re you respect me. All right, and you respect me. Oh, hey! Ricky! 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 As you can see, there was just a prank that he did at Walmart that genuinely pissed off the employees because yes, that is the hallmark of a very sane and lovable person. No, it's not. But he pissed off the employee and the employee just wasn't having it. He didn't want him recording him, anything like that. And it resulted in an altercation which resulted in Jack Doherty just, you know, harassing the guy online just because he was just doing his job and trying to get him out of the store for all the damage he caused. And because of this and many other incidents, he finally decides to go ahead and get a bodyguard. And then he uses that bodyguard to hide behind him and cause a lot of ruckus and problems. And really, no one likes this guy. Honestly speaking, he's just so annoying and he aggravates people to get violent and to get physical. It's not cool to say the least. And and because of that, the person that's suing him is using that against him as a pattern of behavior of just antagonizing people and making them all riled up. But also with the fact that his bodyguard, who used to work for the baby, a rapper that you probably heard about. I honestly I don't care if you know him or not, but he was a bodyguard for the baby and he has a criminal record of assault and battery already. Since he's already committed that crime, Jack Doherty is on the line that his employee doesn't make the same mistake again or commit the same crime. Yet Jack himself, the dipshit that he is, puts him in position to make the same crime happen and it happens. And you want to know the beautiful response he has? His response is, oh, but I gave him $5,000. I'm all good with him. No, dumbass. Like, money doesn't solve everything i'm gonna be very honest here money does not solve everything and the way you have dealt with this entire thing there's this one clip and i'm gonna credit a tozy for this clip because i couldn't find it anywhere else but just watch this exchange and see how the voice of reason is someone other than jack doherty and anyone that's responsible for his entire brand just take a listen yeah, he's the baby security guard yeah, he, he used to know who he was my dog you met him before king yeah but i don't like to see king get in that mode because bro king when he in that mode can't talk to king wrong no bro listen but you put him in that position so when the baby them hit me up and i'm like yo what's up with this kid Bro, you got Kane knocking people out. We, we want to protect Kane. Still open? That's a part of gang. You got to take care of your people. No I did it. I sent them like five bands that day and then said, you can go home and no, do whatever you want. It's not about the money. Uh, but it was to him. him. That's what he said. No. I made it right with him. It ain't about the money, bro. This guy makes a lot of money. That's what I'm trying to teach you. Look at me. I'm Jack Doherty. I have this money that can throw around. Now we can go big people up. That's literally how Jack Doherty sounds in my head half the time whenever I hear him talk and make any kind of logical senses or leaps or bounds. The guy is genuinely a dipshit and I wish he changes his name to Jack Dipshit one day because 
because that's the only way I'm going to reference him as from now onwards. But Jack Dipshit here, like you just saw, cannot comprehend that he made this guy commit a crime, basically putting him in the same situation. And of course, no amount of money is going to like solve this for him unless you're just going to like find a way to take out a jail sentence or something like that. I don't know. Look, you can't you can't reason with stupid at the end of the day and trying to reason with jack dipshit is just like i don't know telling a cat that it's a dog at the end of the day eh, it's just stupid now with that all being said look you're caught up on the entire situation and to be honest i really hope jack loses and he has to pay like a stupid amount of money just to the victim because the victim really does deserve it and with that being said i hope he just stops his bullshittery of content that he puts out it's really not healthy for the internet but with that being said if you like what you saw, like, comment, subscribe, dislike if you dislike it, and practically, I could give less of a shit about Jack Dipshit over here. See ya. Bye.